Ever noticed energy meters of your home? You may see there is some readings in the meter with the unit kWh or kilowatt hour. Ever thought about what is that? What is being measured in those meters? And on what basis you are being charged? In this video, we are going to learn about a key term of electrical world. Welcome to Mr. Smart. Serving knowledge to make you smart. We know that the electric current is the flow of electrons through the conductive material and the force that tends the electron to flow is known as potential difference. When the current flows through the load, it converts electrical energy into other form of energy. For an example, when the current flows through a tungsten filament bulb, the electrical energy flowing into the bulb is converted into light energy. In our previous videos, we have discussed about current, potential difference, and resistance in brief. Have a look to refresh them, link is in description. For a better understanding, the electric current flowing through a conductor is similar to the water flowing from a tank. The force that tends the water flow due to altitude difference is nothing but the potential difference that forces the electron flow. When the water is forced it flows through the pipe. Similarly the electron is forced to flow in the conductor. This flow of electron is the current. What about the water consumed from tank during this flow? This is called as power. An electric power is the amount of electrical energy consumed to produce an output energy like light from our bulb. From the previous illustration, it is clear that the amount of water discharged depends upon the force that pushes water down and the free flow through the pipe. Similarly, the electric power depends upon the potential difference and the current. When they are increased in an electric circuit, the power consumption will also increase. Hence we can say them, they are directly proportional. From this, we can say the theoretical power is the product of potential difference in current. The unit in which the power is measured is called as what? This is what your energy meter measures. Typically, the power is measured in kilowatt hour. Kilowatt hour is the measure of electrical power flowing through the electrical circuit when they are operated for an hour. For an example, a 9 watt bulb consumes 9 watt power when it's turned on for an hour. Whereas a 20 watt bulb consumes 20 watt per hour. Higher the power, higher the consumption is. Generally, devices with higher power consumption produces higher output. That is, a 20 watt bulb glows brighter than the 9 watt bulb. But this won't be true in all cases. Nowadays some smart devices are being created to consume less power and produce more energy. Hope you have learned about electric power in detail. Like, subscribe and click the bell button to get instant updates. Thanks for watching.